Bout number six is brought to you by Clover. Headquartered in Kansas City, Clover is a cannabis-infused product manufacturer that believes in safe, consistent, and quality cannabis products for everyone. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner, Dynamite, Dante, Boos. And his opponent, fighting out of the red corner, Narelle Henry. Oh, baby, let's go. <laughs> Round number one. Sporting touch of hands. Black and red trunks for Dante Boos, black trunks for Norrell Henry. Open chested stance for Henry, immediately switches stances. Started in southpaw to orthodox as he throws that kick. He's trying to explode forward off the jab. That kick off the mark as Henry turns 360. That kick just off the mark as Boos turns 360. Slight forward pressure now from Dante Boos. Almost a Capoeira look there. Capoeira indeed. Full out Capoeira on the cartwheel from Darrell Henry. I guess his walkout was his warm up. We saw a preview of that, Jeff, indeed on Henry's walkout when he hit the cartwheel. I'd like to see Henry set up these kicks with his hands first. Boos staying on the outside. This is with that head kick. See the very open-chested, low-hand stance of Norrell Henry. Henry on his back, on the entry now, Dante Boos. Big right hands from Boos, looking front choke, can't find it. And there's big whiff from both gentlemen with the kicks, and that's just what happens when you don't set it up. Uh, on the last kick that was thrown by Henry, it was caught. Again, no setup makes it easy to catch a kick. And now we see him on his back. Looking side control. No choke to be found there, just head pressure, but now stepping over, looking down at guillotine. There is a choke to find from this position. Boos going hard for the, the finish. Exploding out is Norrell Henry. And it was tied. power. Henry didn't use the most technical escape to get out of that mounted guillotine. Spinning back kick, lands. Big takedown hit by Boos. Big lift and dump from Dante Boos. It lands in side control. And when you were throwing the way Henry throws, where you put your shoulders in front of your hips, it's very easy for someone to get underneath you. And that's what we saw there. That's why we saw a big lift and dump. It's not like it took much strength for him to do that with the way he was throwing. More big shots turning is Henry. Looking front choke again is Boos. Looking guillotine. Tight on that guillotine now. You see the referee, Mike Engler, taking a close look. The thumbs up and then the tap. And the win for Dante Boos. Mounted guillotine finish against the fence. What was odd is we saw a thumbs up a second before the tap. Big win for Boos there. Gets in the, he gets his first win in his MMA career against a very athletic fighter in Henry. for Dante Boos. Well, Henry showed a lot of flash, a lot of creativity. Caught in that guillotine, he was caught earlier in round number one in the mounted guillotine, exploded his way out, gave the thumbs up in this second guillotine locked on by Boos, as we'll see in our replay presented by Major Pack. The Car tap after the thumbs up. Car wheel kick thrown by, by Henry there, and then we see a caught kick, just the, the kicks weren't being set up. Then we saw him explode out of this guillotine, and the way he got up just showed how fatigued he was. And he's fighting in spurts, and, and look at look at the recklessness and, and the big hooks being thrown. It makes the lift easy, and, and shortly thereafter we saw a finish. These big hooks make it easy for, for Boos to just change his level, lift, douse, drop Henry on his back, and, and eventually led, led to that, that front headlock, that, that mounted guillotine choke. Henry had no choice but the tap. Very entertaining fight. 
Well, fighters taking chances. The big guillotine finish for Dante Bruce. Stuff to take away from both fighters. They, they need to set up those low kicks, the, any kicks, really. And, and if you're going to have that flash about you, I, I love it. I'm all about it. Just You have to find spurts for it because it is very tiring to, to throw like that. And I do think fatigue played a factor in this fight. Our winner announcement is presented by Milagro Tequila. We send it back to Brian Wood. Ladies and gentlemen, this bout has ended at 2 minutes and 37 seconds of the very first round. Your winner, due to tap out guillotine choke, out of the blue corner, Dante. Ooh. First win inside an MMA cage for Dante Boos. That's got to feel good. Here in the replay, again, front headlock, mounted guillotine, no arm. And it's it just from a tired fighter already, when you cut off the, the, the breathing there, it just it makes it even faster to tap. Again, you see the thumbs up and then the immediate tap from Narelle Henry. That is win number one in his Ami MMA career for Dante Boos. Victorious by way of first round submission, Dante Boos defeats Norrell Henry.